Hello and welcome to another weekend project from Make Magazine. I'm Kip K. If you've seen any of my other videos, you know that I love lasers. Red, green, blue, there's just something intriguing about laser beams. And there's also a wealth of projects out there. For instance, did you know that you could transmit your voice across the room on the beam of a laser? Well, we're going to do just that on today's weekend project as we build a simple laser communicator. You can find the simple laser communicator by Simon Quillen Field in Make Volume 16. To build this fun project, you'll need an audio output transformer, a solar cell, a small amplifier, a radio, a battery pack, and of course, a regular old laser pointer. First, we'll need to build a battery pack for our laser pointer, and I have a four AA battery pack, but we only need three AA, so we need to run a jumper to complete the circuit for the last battery, and that'll give us all four and a half volts that we need. Now we're going to disassemble the laser pointer by taking out the button cell batteries that come with it and then running jumpers. Uh, one will go to the contact inside the laser pointer and the other will attach to the uh, actual housing of the laser pointer. And then we'll hook those up to our new 4.5 volt battery pack and test it out and we have power on our laser pointer. Now following the schematic along with this video, you'll take the audio output transformer and wire that in line with our power supply and double check and make sure that the laser pointer is still working. Now the last connection for our transmitter is going to be a mini cable with a stripped ends and that will be attached also to the audio output transformer which completes the transmitter end of our simple laser communicator. To build the receiver, we need a small solar cell, and this one maxes out at only a half volt, but it'll do the job for us. Now, just a word of caution, these little solar cells are very delicate, so handle them with care or they'll snap in a heartbeat. Now we're going to plug an audio cable into our mini amplifier, and that audio cable will have stripped ends, which will attach to the positive and negative wires that we soldered to the solar cell. And now it's time to test it out. So we're going to use a little transistor radio, and we're going to plug our connector from our transmitter into the radio and set everything up and see how it works. Now what happens is the audio signal varies the power that's going to the laser so that its brightness changes. At a receiving end, the solar cell converts the oscillating light signal back into the original sound. Well, now that we've transmitted a radio signal across the room from our laser pointer to our solar cell, it's easy enough to turn this into a simple communicator by replacing the speaker on the solar cell end with a set of headphones or an earplug and replacing the radio on the transmitting end with a microphone. So that's how you transmit a radio signal across the room in spy mode. And we'll see you next week with another project you can build over the weekend.